Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Zeus Dog Moose, if you didn't already know. And today, as you can see from the screen, we are just showcasing the new Black Steel characters. Right there, we have the Medic. We're gonna, we're just gonna fly through them all and show you. I do got some gameplay as well. Right here, we have the Black Steel Locust Grenadier Elite. I went ahead and gave you guys a 360. This is on the Esports Supporter Pack 5. They are out now. Black Steel Bernie as well. Shout out to my boy GSQ Helios for making this possible. You guys should check out his opening video. He got every character in the packs. Ridiculous for spending that much, but it's pretty dope. We also got Black Steel Rom. He's looking like a beast. I really like his cut up. Looking clean, looking clean. But the character mostly everyone is looking for is Black Steel Savage Cantus. I got a chance to play with him as well. Very dope. If you guys want to see some character gameplay, I could use Helios' account more. But until then, I'm just going to keep playing. Alright guys, so right here I just got some Guardian gameplay for you. It was actually a really good game. I went 18-0. and zero. I didn't get enough time to make as many showcases of the characters I could because I was in a hurry. And since I was playing on Helios' account, I didn't want to play on his account all night or do something. But um, I was only the medic one round this game. But mainly I just want to hop on the mic to talk to you guys and showcase these characters. So that's pretty cool. But um, we're going to go through the gameplay, maybe talk about some pinpoints right here. If you guys are wondering, I am holding down leader because I'm waiting to see where they spawn so we can understand map control. I do drop that drop shot and get an on-screen quad, baby. You think it's over? No! He takes out his Nasher, gets that on-screen quint. But you know what the game does to me? It bullshits me, and I don't even get a quint ribbon. <laughs> but yeah, guys, so I'll just talk through... This is a new platform I want to start bringing to my videos, guys. I really do think montaging is dead for Gears of War. I mean, we could def definitely raise the standards and bring back incredibility and people's credibility. And, like, if people started holding out on clips more, um, montages can create those amazing standards once again. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Like, if you watch any of my videos, like, any of my, like, little feed me's or my uh, videos that are actually clip-based videos, like... When I set those up, those clips are usually like three or four days. Like, I don't save up clips for like a month or two. If I did that, like, the standards for the clip would be ridiculous. But, um, check this out real quick, guys. I was panicking. I got downed. I was trying to have a flawless gameplay. I was like, Ronnie, shout out to S. Ronnie. I was, help me, dude. Help me, help me. Pop. He popped him with the Marska to save my life to help the perfection of the gameplay. Look, I, I was like, let me hug you, bro. But, uh, shout out to my boy Ronnie as well as GSQ Helios, Emotions AE. You guys want to check out all their channels, show some love, that's what it's all about. But um, just to talk about uh, standards and montages, I'm not saying I will stop doing montages. I just decided for like when I release those mass clips that I do be releasing, honestly, I do those just to be active. I do those just to show you guys that I still play randomly. I can still get some kills, you know what I mean? But um, it's not... It's not like, I don't upload those to be like, oh my god, like, check out these amazing clips. And since that's, like, the case scenario in my mind, I shouldn't be uploading those like that anymore for montages. If I'm not trying to wow you guys, I shouldn't upload half-ass montages. I mean, don't get me wrong, like, I still drop on-screen quins and you guys like it, but, you know, I'm gonna work harder. So, my new ideal is, uh... To start dropping more, you know, gameplays, more montages, like the 10-minute montage, maybe just drop 7, 8, 10-minute montages, and then instead of, you know, doing the usual, just drop some music, I'll commentate over it. I could talk about some controversial stuff in the community, or new topics, or new weapons, or new characters, skins, or whatever that are coming out. So basically, it allows me to be able to drop my content, my clips, and have the fun I do have fun with, but also we could talk about topics that do go viral in the Gears community. And it will cause and stir more attention to the channel as well as the community. So um, I will still be doing montaging. I just want to promote the game itself more. And montaging will be within it. You know what I mean? Montaging is just something I'll always do. I'll always be going for clips because I'm just having fun. And that's what I like to do. But um, I really like to do this now. You know, I realized off the bat that this wasn't a showcase of the character. This was more of a reveal of the characters being out. So you guys can know it's out. But um, both clips I hit in this game, I happen to be a leader. I couldn't even get a clip with the character. How ridiculous. So I did just spoil it. I am getting another clip in this video. <laughs> Let's see what we get. But um, yeah, guys, I just really want to try something new. I want to be more interactive. And like the feedback on my montages are always incredible, dude. And like that's why I started YouTube. Like I was just, you know, an underground like pub stomper, like someone who just tried hard and like I got a lot of like support for it and like it really really blew my mind and that's what I started creating bases videos off of and like the basis behind my channel. 
So like basically I, what I'm saying is I always want to do that, but like I really want to take that next leap in the Gears community. And I think doing like for me, for someone like myself who like currently is dropping so many just, you know, outplays, quad videos and stuff like that, like I can still get my point across for the people who want to watch montage. Basically, I'm giving my fans an opportunity. I know some of you come strictly for gameplay and commentary and like tips, and then some of you come for the montage. So if I mix it up the way I have been, it can be a mix of, you know, gameplay commentary, but with the clips of some try hard action. So um, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go ahead and let it play out with this clip. We down leader, I'm being a dick, I'm waiting for the spawn. I dropped that drop shot, get the on-screen quad. I turned the corner with my console shotgun. Shotgun, I mean my console white drop shot. Let's get it, baby, for the on-screen Quint to win the game going uh I believe 18 and 0. Let's check it out real quick. 18 and 0 indeed. No crazy competition or anything, but it was just to showcase the characters. So if you haven't yet and you do like to buy Black Steel or E Supporter Packs, go check them out. Some pretty dope characters. But as always, homies, much love and peace out. Where do I begin? Confused by where to start. Does anybody know what to do with a heavy heart? Follow me around as if I invited the dark. And it seems like everything in my life is falling apart. I go hard, but I feel like I'm going nowhere fast. Fog on the future, hanging on to the past. Doing odd jobs, trying to pick up some fair cash. Cutting my time.